Yes, the names of our kayaks came from historical links with Scotland. Um, there's, as pe most people know, there was a strong uh, Norwegian Viking heritage in Scotland. The Outer Islands were populated by huge numbers of, of Norse people. And we took the names, the four kayak names. One was called Godred, who was a king, a Norwegian king. Uh, one that was Gus's kayak. The, another kayak was called um, Summerland, which is mine, named after a, a Norse Scottish king called King Summerland, who ruled in the Western Isles. Uh, third kayak was called a Nivig, which is old Gaelic for little ship. And the fourth one was called Scuta. And the Scuta was the name of the Viking longship. So Godred had his Scutas and Summerlid had his Nivigs. And they fought a huge battle off the, the west coast of Scotland. And I think that the it's the only sea battle that Vikings have recorded as ever having lost.